because my knees have got arthritis. Henry Daddy says the doctor cures a kidney sponsolitis. Oh, oh the, the pain! pain. Not again. Urethritis, uveitis, retinitis, salpingitis, dermatitis and mumps. Meningitis group, bruises and bumps. Or another case of enteritis and sprue. Not a bit about what else is new. Think I'll give them all a dose of my pink medicine. Try pink medicine. Why pink, pink medicine? medicine? Educated patients always think pink medicine. Drink pink medicine. So... All our symptoms vanish down the sink, pick medicine, drink pink medicine, think pink medicine, sit and take your medicine, drink a dinky medicine, think pink medicine, go! No, I'm afraid Dr. Cameron and Dr. Finlay both retired years ago. There's only Dr. Snotty here, the new. Bye, <laughs> you'll be here soon. Cheery bye. Oh. Good morning, Dr. Snorty. <laughs> Look at this. I... Who's been tidying up in here? Oh, I don't know, Dr. Snorty. Oh, it must have been that locum. <laughs> oh. We haven't had a locum since you went on holiday five years ago. So why didn't he leave things as they were? Uh, <coughs> uh, uh, right. Uh, let's have the first one in here then. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, hello, Doctor. Um, I've been losing a lot of weight. Ah, good. Well done. Right. <laughs> uh, no, 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 Doctor, Doctor, Doctor. Look at these trousers. Six months ago, these trousers fitted me really tightly, but now look at them. Uh, right, uh, take these. <laughs> that will keep you going for a fortnight when you go <laughs> Right! Next! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Doctor. I'm Mrs. Molesworth. Uh, remember? Molesworth. Molesworth. Uh, uh. Morrison, Mosley, Mo... Mo? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's the under the cross? What's the under the cross? Oh, there's a towel gone, isn't it? I get to wipe my hands on Right then, uh, What's the trouble now? Uh, yes, yeah. well, I've got a sore throat and a, and a cough. Sore throat and a cough? <coughs> oh, dear. I don't look at that. And, uh, oh, that's no good, is it? Right. Try this one. Right, open wide. Ah! Uh, uh. <laughs> Nasty. What is it? Woodworm. <laughs> uh, just pump you a bit. Hold on. Uh. We better uh, take your temperature, I'll right? tell uh, yeah, I can't get. Uh, 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 oh, Christ, get it. <laughs> right, uh, hold, hold on. Uh, oh, barometer, that's right. This little bit. Oh, I think you're on my pet. Come on, that's it. Hang on, that's it. That's enough, right? <coughs> <Sorry. coughs> Wet and windy. <laughs> Now listen, we just want to listen to your chest then, right? I'll get in there. <coughs> You've got a very nasty chest, my dear. <laughs> you need an X-ray. Here you are. Right, take this one. Here you are. Right, next. Good morning, Doctor. <laughs> It appears, Doctor, that I have this boil on my neck, and it's very painful. Oh, right. Well, I'll have to lance it for you. Uh, <laughs> sterilizer. St sterilizer. Uh, right. Uh, <coughs> Look, uh, I don't seem to have my scalpel handy. <coughs> uh, 
Is, isn't it about time you got a new set of instruments, Doctor? Well, look, I don't have enough coupons, do I? <laughs> uh, scalpel, scalpel, scalpel. Ah, uh, uh, here we are. have discovered the cure for the common cold. <laughs> you know you've got the makings of a top-class thyroid surgeon, but for one thing... Oh, what's that, sir? Well, we all admire your style, and you look pretty good in theatre green, but why spoil the line of good surgical gowns with the ugly line of your underpants? <laughs> Why not try the Surgipant Theatre? <laughs> yes, you can now look good from behind as well as beneath with the Surgipant Theatre. Clinging theatre undergarment that shows your lines, not your underpants. The Theatre has a magic finger panel too to smooth out unsightly bulges. Yes, the Surgipant Theatre with a new cluster adjuster. The surgeon's most loyal support, next to a nurse. looking a lot better, Mr. Parker. <laughs> Hello, Anthea. Hello. I just wanted to introduce you to my New Auxiliary nurse. She joined the ward this morning, nurse doctor. Uh, yes, sister nurse. Can I introduce you to my husband, Andrew? Uh, uh, doctor, nurse, nurse doctor. How, How do you do? do? <laughs> oh, uh, there's my new laboratory technician, Anthony Doctor. Anthony, let me introduce you. Mr. Doctor, my wife, sister nurse, her nurse, nurse doctor, <laughs> Mr. Doctor. <laughs> no relation, I believe. <laughs> Doctor, uh, nice to have you with us. Uh, Andrew, uh, Doctor Nurse has told me a lot about you. Uh, hello, Sister Nurse. What's this? A trade union meeting? <laughs> <laughs> hello, Mr. Patient. Let me introduce you. This is Andrew Nurse, my husband, the doctor, my nurse, Nurse Doctor, and Mr. Doctor, my husband's colleague. This is Mr. Albert Patient, the new hospital secretary. Thank mm. you, Nurse. Oh, yes, of course. Yes. I've seen your signature at the bottom of the new hospital circulars. A patient. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> <laughs> And you're a nurse. <laughs> Always gives me a giggle. <laughs> I don't see why. <laughs> you see, you're a doctor and sign a nurse. Well, our Angela doctor is a nurse and signs a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> My chest! My chest! <laughs> Thank you. Put out the cardiac arrest form at once. Mr. Doctor, get 
a doctor. Uh, but you're a doctor, Doctor Nurse. No, no, not a doctor. A doctor. Uh, well, <laughs> which doctor? Not a witch doctor. A doctor. <laughs> Doctor, nurse doctor, go and get her at once. Oh, uh, sister nurse, will you get nurse doctor for doctor nurse? Yes, Mr. Doctor. <laughs> nurse doctor? Yes, sister nurse. Mr. Doctor wants you. Doctor nurse wants you, nurse doctor. Uh, he's all right, nurse doctor. Just get a porter quickly. Uh, yes, doctor nurse. Oh, there you are. Doctor nurse wants you. Oh. Uh, who is this, nurse doctor? Uh, Anthea Porter, medical social worker. Uh, doctor <laughs> nurse. <laughs> no, no, no. Not a porter. A porter. A? Uh, a porter. An porter. Oh, you mean Anne Porter, the physiotherapist? <laughs> no! Uh, oh, I think I'm going to be all right. Oh, well, do you need me now, then? No, thank you, Miss Porter. Dr. Nurse wanted a porter. A... a porter. Anne Porter. Oh! Oh, you mean Anne Porter, the physiotherapist? <laughs> Doctor. It's a porter. We don't need a porter now. No, a porter. <laughs> Anthea Porter. I think she's going to be a patient. No, I'm a patient, Mr. Doctor. <laughs> well, Mr. Patient, will you get a porter? Anthea Porter's going to be a patient of Dr. Nurse. Oh, and uh, Nurse Doctor, will you get me a trolley? Do you mean Abraham Trolley, the porter, or Alexander Trolley, the doctor? Any trolley! <laughs> Any trolley? There's no such person. <laughs> In a bloody hospital like this, it is a wonder any doctoring gets done at all. Well, what do you mean? I mean it is a wonder any doctoring gets done. Nay, Homer. Who the hell are you? I'm Doctor Ing. I just got done. <laughs> And you said? I'm Dr. Ng. I just got done. I see. Well, uh, come to see me in a fortnight if it still tickles when you sneeze. Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Hinckley. Yes, that's right. Yes. Now, I saw you first time with your chest in April Yes, last year. it was the rising damp that was doing it. The rising damp, yes, yes. And we gave you the green tablets. They was no good. Yes, yes. So we added to that the blue inhaler. And that weren't strong enough. Yes. So we gave you the red mixture with the yellow spotted tablets. Was they stronger? Yes, they was, yes. They well, <laughs> didn't do no good. That rising dam gets to you something cruel. Yes, the rising dam, hmm. yes, yes. And last week we gave you the very, very strong brown medicine. Well, now, did, uh, did that do any good? No. Haven't you got anything stronger? Well, you see... You must have something stronger. I can take any amount of that ordinary stuff. You... Give me something stronger. Yes, yes. Well, we do have something just a little stronger. Excuse me. Uh, don't breathe in, please. <laughs> These gloves are asbestos. <laughs> Excuse me. Spoonfuls in a bowl, put it in the middle of the floor, and lie down with a cloth over your head. Will it do me any good? No. But it will certainly cure the rising damp. <laughs> Here, 
occurred in St. Ebsworth's clinic. A remarkable breakthrough is causing a revolution in treatment that may soon benefit thousands of people of all ages suffering from a wide range of common handicaps. In the treatment room, the psychiatrist meets his patient for the first time. Hello, Peter. I'm a London psychiatrist. Oh, really? As far as our tests have shown, your disease isn't serious. Oh, really? In fact, it may even be curable. Oh, really? Peter has a realist disease. <laughs> We've decided to try you on a new form of treatment. Oh, really? Our treatment is not like the ordinary psychiatric group therapy. It's more like a sort of club. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> um, is that thing a camera? Yes, it is, Peter. Oh. oh really? <laughs> That was Peter. But Dr. London's psychiatrist has used the same therapy in other common diseases, with equally promising results. Now, this is your first session with me. Right. You're in your middle thirties. Right. And you're an advertising manager of a leading North London abattoir. Right. This is Wright's disease. And as bad a case as I've ever seen. Right. <laughs> Dr. London, psychiatrist, you've been involved in this form of therapy for the last, what, five years? Yes. And in the last, what, two years, you've seen, what, 20 patients a year. That's, what, 40 patients in all, or, what, two patients a month? I have Watts disease. <laughs> Tell me, would you be able to help me at all? How long have you had the condition? Since I was, what, 20 <laughs> After only two months of treatment, remarkable progress has been made. Hello, Peter. You feeling better now? Yes. You playing with your new toy? Yes. What is it? A chop chop? Yes. Peter is now a cabinet minister. <laughs> completely free of the once dreaded Oh, really? Is it? Yes, with perseverance, over 80% of patients can be cured. Though the cost of labor and dedication of staff is not without its sacrifices. Really? What? What? Yes, right, right, right on. Really? What? Yes. What? <laughs> Next week, we'll be discussing the fascinating question. Um, yes. Next week, we'll be discussing the fascinating. Yes, he's just past me, so he should be with you any moment. Well, Mr. Plutus, we've reached a diagnosis. We now know what's wrong with you. It's bad news, isn't it, Doctor? No, it's not. It is. <laughs> what is the diagnosis? I'd like to know. I wouldn't. Of course you would. He wouldn't. I would? Well, it's Shibolsky's syndrome. Is that serious? No, it's not. It is. It is? It isn't. It, it isn't. isn't. It is. Um, tell me, Doctor, is there another name for Shibolsky's syndrome? Yes. We also call it ingrown toenail. <laughs> I'll have to operate. I'm afraid it'll be very painful. <laughs> of course, I don't enjoy it when my patients are in great pain. <coughs> I do. <laughs> I know you don't, Doctor, and I can tell you I will not enjoy being in great pain. I will. <laughs> he won't. I won't. He won't. But that's not your usual forceps. It is. I know, it's a bit of a surprise. It isn't. It is. <laughs> uh, it is a surprise. It isn't. It's for you. What, what right now? Uh, but I haven't finished here yet. 
I have. <laughs> oh, uh, sister, where's my next, uh, my next uh, pa patient uh, at all? Uh, did you know, do you know which, which one of the, uh, uh, excuse me, um, yes, hello? What, what, what? Oh, you can't, you can't speak. Yes, I see, you can't speak. Um, uh, can you tell me why you can't speak? Oh, no, you can't speak, so you can't tell me why you can't speak. Um, is it, is it your, oh, your mouth, your mouth, your mouth, mouth is stuck open. Your mouth is stuck open. Yes, I see. Well, tell me why your mouth is stuck open. No, no, you can't speak, you can't speak. Well, why can't you speak? Because your mouth is stuck open. Yes, I see. Um, we'll look, we'll look, uh, we'll do a mime. He's going to do a mime for us. Isn't it exciting? Um, uh, uh, is that Barbara Windsor? Barbara Windsor. Yes, no, no, sorry. Yes, yes, you. Sorry. Oh, cricket, cricket. Yes, I see cricket, cricket, cricket. cricket. You feel the and a cricket ball got jammed in your mouth. No, no, you, 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 you scored a five. They scored a five, didn't they do well? A five, a good five, well done. Oh, I see a six, a six, a six, it's called a six, it's called a six. It's called a big square. Malcolm Muggeridge, isn't it? No, no, sorry. Climbing um, right. over the boundary, over the boundary. Over the boundary, you banged your forehead on, 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 no, look, 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 look over there, look over there, look over there, look over there, look over there. Charles Lawton, Hunchback and Lawton. No? no, lower down, lower down. Lord Longford, isn't it? Lord Longford. No, 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 no. Oh, apes, 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 apes. You were playing cards with apes and you lost all your money and your mouth fell open with surprise. No. It's, a, it's a banana, banana, banana. Apes, banana, apes, banana. Zoo, zoo over there, over the cricket boundary into the zoo. Yes. Big ears, big ears. Prince Charles was opening the zoo. No, 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 big, big ears and a long nose, and a long nose, and, and a big funny walk. <laughs> giraffe, is it? No, no, sorry, giraffe's got a short ears and a small nose and a mincing one. No, I know what you mean. Um, elephant, elephant, elephant. Elephant there, elephant there, you, you, you banana, you banana, you banana, banana skin, banana skin, banana skin. You fell on a banana skin on the ground, and an elephant came and trod on your... 